This is Florian and today I want to show you our current state of bamboo lip. So first we need to import pandas, then we read the Titanic dataset as always and now we look at the data frame and something is new. There is a new button, the show bamboo lip user interface button. And if I click on it, I will get a full-blown user interface, an interactive user interface for the pandas data frame. So I can scroll through have a look at all my columns, I can scroll through the rows, can scroll to the, uh, to the end, whatever I want, and this also works with millions of rows. So let's do some manipulations. First we want to split the name, we want to split the string, separate the first name and the last name. In the end we can see there are the two new columns, we can rename them into last name and first name then let's have a look at the age column at the histogram to understand the data better I can also rebin the histogram if I like and let's say I only want to filter columns where age is below 18 do this here then let's say I also want to sort age, ascending, also done. And something else that's very common is we need to adjust the data type. So let's change the data type of survived into an actual Boolean. And in the end, let's select only the relevant columns for another analysis. So in this case, I want to select survived, P class, the sex, the age, and the first name and last name. And next, there is one of the main features of Bamboola that we promised you, and this is the live code export. So this is all the code that Bamboola has just written for you, and you did nothing for this. All the pandas code just ready for you. You can also have a look at the history where you see all the steps like manipulate the strings, rename the columns, keep the rows, like all the steps that we did before. And now you can even change the history and see how this interacts with the code. So if you undo a step, this will also change the code. And of course you can recover it. So that was just the tip of the iceberg of what's possible with Bamboolip. In the next videos, I will show you more. For example, I will show you how Bamboolip works on big data sets with millions of rows. We will show you more advanced data visualization features and some other transformations. So I hope to see you soon and have a great day.